Hi guys, thanks so much for watching. Just a quick message to all of you guys who haven't heard yet, we are having a big Mapuai Squad giveaway. I'm flying you, yes, you, you, you out there, to the Philippines. For full contest details, be sure to read the description box. All right, and now to the vlog. Come on, guys. All right, my boy squad, it's the moment of truth. It's the big day. Thank you. It's show day. Yes. Oh, here we go, my boy squad. This is going to be an adventure. All right, so Legaya right now is at home with RJ sisters, Jane and Judith Garcia. Mate Elsie's right here. Hi. We're now getting ready for sound check. All right, guys. So this show is actually the opening of a restaurant, which you saw in a previous vlog. That was their soft opening. Now they're doing their grand opening here at Six Doors Buffet. See, we were here a few days ago. Remember this? Mm -hmm. um, well, they've invited me here to do a set, and I'm excited about it. We got, are you a I vlogger too? too? Yeah. Oh, she's a vlogger too. Right What's there. your channel? Events with Banks TV. Oh. Events with Banks TV. Check oh. it out. Oh. Like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Hi, Jaya. Yes, editor of the vlogs. Mm -hmm. She's also helping take some footage of this <laughs> epic <laughs> event. All right, this is the stage. Yes, I kind of rather like the ocean background, <laughs> but I think they're gonna change it for this show. Had I known they had an ocean background, I would have sang Baby Shark, doo -doo 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 -doo, Baby Shark. Just kidding. Um, so, this set is kind of an interesting set because a lot of my shows here in the Philippines, they're more comedy shows um, because here in the Philippines, I'm more known for my comedy music and the comedy skits and that sort of thing. But today I kind of wanted to do something a little special. I wanted to do like serious singing. Like, yeah, my spiels will have comedy, but I did want to sing like, good, like really, really sing tonight. All right, guys, gonna do some sound checking now. Here are my sound monitors so I can hear myself, so I don't have to hear myself through the sound speakers. Because if you do that, you can be off time and you can be off key. When you're standing before me with tears in your eyes, trying to tell me that you found you one mother. What did you think? I'll take this moment, look at the stars. Okay, so finished sound check. Um, now it's just waiting. <laughs> this is our holding room. Yep. Quite large and spacious. It's just very cold. They're gonna lower the air conditioning. For some people, cold temperatures ruin their voice, like it somehow hinders their voice. For me, I'm from Canada. I mean, I grew up in the cold and I sung in the cold. But, uh, so cold doesn't affect my voice, ice cream, none of that. But if it's super duper cold, what happens is muscles kind of like work slower somehow. And so that can affect singing for me. I mean, the vocal cords, right? It's a muscle, right? So if it gets cold, of course it's gonna work slower. You know what I'm saying? Um, so in that way, cold can affect my singing, but generally it doesn't. RJ, is there an expected number for tonight that are attending? I'm not sure. 20? For sure more. 50? For sure more. More than 50? I thought this was gonna be an intimate show. 100? It's more than 100. <gasps> 200. Okay. 100 is okay. That's a small audience. I love doing these kinds of shows because it's more intimate. It affects the way I communicate with my audience 
um, and it also affects the chemistry and feel of of like the venue during the show. I know it sounds really vague and artsy fartsy, but no, really, it does matter. I like to go out there, look at the crowd, and as soon as I evaluate the crowd, those first few moments, I already am reconstructing how I'm going to do my spiels in between my songs, how I'm gonna use the stage, how I'm gonna interact with the audience, and there's just so much going on in my mind during a show. Um, but an audience of 100 is a lot of fun. All right. Another thing I also love about a small audience is that if I totally screw up and make a fool of myself, only a hundred people saw it. <laughs> Unless, of course, they're recording the performance and then they upload it or they're live streaming, which I find is happening more and more at my shows. <laughs> you and my Buhai squad are so fun. If you do that, just don't upload the bad stuff. Guys, two hours to show time. So I'm gonna eat a little bit. Mm, look at this. This right here, beef rendang <laughs> and crab bowls, crab cakes. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Now, being too full does affect my performance. I can't sing when I'm too full for whatever reason. But I got two hours. It's alright. Should be alright. Mm. Beef rendang. Mmm, 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 mmm. Wow, oh my gosh, mmm, reminds me of Malaysia. So good. Mm. Ate Elsie is enjoying the desserts. Moose, masarap? Okay, so she's never had that kind of dessert, so she, it's not her favorite, she says. <laughs> There's ice cream and halo halo too, like a bunch of amazing fruits, cakes. All right, guys, flowers arrived. Gonna be using this during my set. Um, I like my sets to be really interactive, especially for um, an intimate audience like this. Um, I'll be giving this out to people in the audience for one of the songs. You can take it home. Oh, and they're fresh. They're still dewy. All right. They've also been dethorned, which is good because sometimes when we request to have flowers in our rider, um, they come with thorns and then we have to remove them ourselves. It's black velour <laughs> jacket, a cream shirt, and these pants. Yes. Um, and there's one more final touch. I'm gonna be wearing these so that I look different just for the first few songs. I was able to also take a snooze right there. I, n I napped. <laughs> Oh, I was so tired. And now I need to wake up. You know what I'm saying? Another band is up performing right now, and I'm after some hot coffee. Okay. Now I gotta do warm ups. Okay, so for warm ups, it's always different. Sometimes I just start with. You see, see how I screwed up there? It means. My lips are not relaxed. Then I do face warm ups. Look at this. It looks weird, but trust me, it helps. And then I do stretches, get used to moving big. Because, as you know, performing is not just going up to a mic and singing, like, it's performing. So sometimes you gotta, like, do big movements. You know what I mean? <laughs> And it sometimes gets real physical. So I like to go like this. It's as if I'm starting a workout, you know, like stretch. It's all part of the warm up. And then I go over the difficult parts of the show in my brain. Like, I'm for sure gonna screw up my second song, the Ed Sheeran song uh, cover, but I'll do that after. Um, and certain high notes, like 
one note I have to hit is Oh, cause I, I need I need to hit that So I'll continue doing that mm -hmm. I'm not gonna bust my voice doing it but Just just to practice, you know what I'm saying? And then a lot of Breathing in Lung exercises Try to breathe in as much air as I can To expand my lungs Breathe it out. Yeah. All right. That's kind of what my warm up is like. Mabuhay Squad meets Sam. She is uh, pretty much handling this entire event, organizing it. Thank you so much. Um, how many songs left till we go up? There's only four songs left. Oh. I'll call you on the last three songs. Oh, all right. Mabuhay Squad, we're going up soon. Thank you. Thank you. Soon. Four songs left. Usually that's around four minutes each. We got 16 minutes. I think they're announcing me now. Also, Canadian Idol season one finalists. Yep, they're announcing me. Where's my mic? OMG! Okay, they just announced me. Take photos of me, put Twitter and FB on oh my signature's an autograph. I can sign them super fast. Wikipedia knows my past. Email for a mail from fans. Selling in five continents. My name is Mick. Oh, you're welcome. Congratulations. Amazing. 
amazing moment. Thank you so much for having me. Thank you, yes. Where can they find such stores? Guys, we have friends here. Hello. Thank you guys for coming and they like gave some really cool gifts. Thanks so much. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Selfie. Yeah. My boy squad, you guys are so great. Guys, meet Louis. He's from Chicago. Yes, thanks for coming. And look, I have to sign a, a, an American dollar bill. Isn't this illegal in the US? Oh well, we're not in the US. <laughs> Guys, I'd like you to meet Gail from San Pablo. Thank Hi, you for coming. Yeah. I really appreciate it. Yeah. Oh, boys, you're, you're amazing, everywhere. Mikey. Ah, you're amazing. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Australia. Hi there. Hi. All of you people in Australia, hi there. I miss Oz. Chloe here has a journal. This is a great, a great book to start. I love that. There you go. Omg, RJ, look, Chloe gave us something. Thank you, thank you. Oh, I love Australia. Chloe, thank you so much. That's really kind. Thank you. You're vlogging me, and I'm vlogging you. <laughs> Vlogception, she says. So awesome. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of goodies already. Okay? okay, so guys, now they're showing us a demo of something really cool. So look at this, look at this room. First of all, all of this stuff is like projected on the walls. Wow. This, is this New York? Oh, this is New York. Okay. Oh wait, there's a demonstration. Oh my, it's the galaxy. <gasps> Okay, so I'm gonna sit down. Let's sit down. RJ, sit down. Oh, this is different. So they offer this at six doors. This is what is this called? 3D? This is our VIP room. It's part of the magical train. So it's VIP like room. The door. We bring it to another place. So just like oh, one. wow. We are in New York. So aside from the wall projection, the highlight of this room is actually the main. Wow, table mapping? Oh! 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 Oh, wow! What? That is awesome! Oh! Wow! Oh, so cool! That is... Can you... Oh, wow! So cute, that little thing! What a cool dining experience! Oh! <gasps> Oh, it's like... <laughs> hey, I wish I had this little one to help me chop vegetables for the guy. And it is a bird. Oh, cute. I like it. How awesome. That is so different. What's it doing? Oh, oh it's making soup. Oh. <laughs> 
That is such a trip. So it's preparing your soup. So after you prepare your soup, the presentation ends, and then your butler comes in and serves oh. you the same soup. Oh, cool. So, okay, so when this is done, the server comes and actually gives you the soup that you watch this little bird make for you. Oh, how neat. That is so cool. And there's like random, oh, there's like random marine creatures swimming on your table. I love the habitat, actually. Oh! Oh my! Oh my, something's going on. Oops! Oh! Oh, so cool! It looks so real! It's like, oh, I would eat this. Mm. That is so awesome. Presentation, the projection turns off. What a cool thing! Amazing! Wow! Look at where we are, guys. We're in China. We're in China now. This is China. Awesome! I love the little fireflies flying around, like bioluminescent dragonflies. Okay, so it's a six-course menu, and every course they change the ambiance. It's a different part of the world. Oh wow! Oh wow! Okay, so after the seafood soup is Chinese dim sum, hence we're in China guys. What a cool, and it's coming out from up there? Wow, what amazing technology. I love this. What a unique dining experience. Mabuhai Squad, have you seen anything like this? I sure haven't. This is really neat. RJ, I want this in our Mabuhai Squad house. <laughs> Make it happen. RJ, how was it? The performance? Great. Yeah. Ang galing ni Sir. Salamat. Thank you. And thank you, Jaya, for taking beauty shots with the 5D Mark III. Mm -hmm. Oh, all right. Another show done. So happy. I just hope my voice holds up. Because I got to edit for Ants Canada. And I need to record the voiceover. I can't be going AC family. Behold. The antiverse. I can't be talking like that. You know what I mean? Someone is in bed. Sorry. I just came to say hi. Yes. Missed you this evening. Mm hmm. Yes, I missed you too. I had to sing. Mm hmm. But tomorrow we'll hang out. Mm hmm. Sleep, okay? Sleep well. Sleep well. Sleep, sleep, sleep. See you in the morning. Mm hmm. Good morning guys, alright, so thankfully my voice is still around, um, but I woke up to the most alarming sight, oh my gosh, my voice squad, OMG. Now I was gone for a lot of yesterday, so it was at the LC, we left around 3 p.m. and we're gone till like nighttime when we come back, as you saw. But I am afraid that that disappearance might have stressed the Gaia. I don't know. The Wuhan Squad, look at what I found at the bottom of the Gaia's fridge this morning. 